I know you don't smoke weed. I know this. But I'm gonna get you high today. Because it's Friday, you ain't got no job, and you ain't got shit to do. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Iceberg Slum, aka Coach of Don. We on JV TV Anime. I'm here with my guy once again. Chick, how you doing? Hey, I'm we jumping in to some One Piece Zoro versus Fuji Tour. Uh, I know we was having a discussion about this like probably two weeks ago on who we was going to take in a 1v fight today. Honestly, going off of everything I've seen in Wano, I'm going to get an edge to my nigga Zoro right now. But if you feel me, definitely. <laughs> I would love to hear any uh, explanation as to why. I, I, I would love to give it to my boys, Zoro, you know what I'm saying? Typically, on normal circumstance. But the way Oda be writing the story, mm -hmm. why would he give Fuji Toro an admiral position if he wasn't like that? I do think he's like that. <laughs> I, I don't want to get that message true. But I also want to state that Green Bull has an admiral position, correct? Yes. Okay, so cool. <laughs> I think Zoro would also bitch Green Bull. First of all, not to say that it wouldn't be a good fight between Zoro and Fuji Tour. How many other admirals is Zoro class with? Mm -hmm. Crazy enough, I feel like Zoro could beat Kizaru at this point where he at right now. Ah, uh, only because of what I've seen in Wano. I, I don't. I can't give him Akainu, and I don't know if I'd give him Aokiji. Uh, but I feel like maybe think he could can beat Kizaru right now. Only because I feel like Kizaru was the weakest out of the three. Or am I wrong? He probably is, but you still think yeah. he can be Keys Arm right now. I feel like we were honestly underestimating how big a piece Inla is. Like, if it, if it was just another sword, okay. But this is, this isn't just a regular sword. Like, I feel like he just got supremely stronger with the addition of, oh, okay, now he has Converse Hockey. Nah, too. I'm not even knocking that. You think he's all has a uh, conference hockey? He, he got something. <laughs> he got something, but I don't know if it's that. Oh, no, he ain't, he ain't got that. I'm being not. Probably not. So Zora vs. Fuji Toro. Hmm. A lot that's happened in two years. All right, you're right. You're a right. lot of training's gone by. A lot of wars. New transformations are going left and right. People are doing new attacks. Yeah, Zora, a lot can happen in two Zora years. Zora like Kaido by itself. <laughs> That's what I'm. That's what I'm saying. I, I ain't gonna lie. By itself. I think Fuji Tor could do the things I saw Zoro doing in Wano. I think he would do things differently. I don't know if he'd be, be able to withstand that combo attack that Zoro took. But I know, I feel like he could have made in other ways. So we're saying that Zoro's hockey is stronger than Fuji Tor right now. Because if Zoro's hockey is stronger, then of course. You know what I'm saying? I do think Zoro's hockey is stronger than Fuji Tor's. At this point, yeah. I, I, think, like, I think he has a cold ass devil fruit. And damn near OP. Zoro's. But I think Zoro's hockey is, is, is next level. Like, then they're finally awakened. And he has a sword that sucks in Ryu every time he's using it. It won't be a quick fight. Like Fujitora probably gonna have to pull out a few tricks, but in the end Zoro probably gonna come away with that help. 